Welcome to the second video in our reactor introduction series. In this video, we're going to be discussing printer and material selection. In the previous video, we showed you the basics of how to use reactor and navigate its systems. Again, we're going to be returning to the left toolbar. And here, highlighted by my mouse, we see the printer selection. So we open this menu by left clicking on it. We see each of our six major printers available. I like to stick with the F410.4. Just below that, we have the material type and the brand selection. And below that again is the quality. So to go ahead and select a material, we can open this menu here and go down to the more materials. This opens the material profile selection where we can search by type, brand, or name by clicking at the top. This is gonna sort alphabetically. So let's just go ahead and choose one out of them. To add it to our menu, we're gonna select the PLA and check the checkbox. So let's get another PLA. We'll do filaments.ca and let's get an ABS. We'll do FlashForge. To close this, we're going to click Save. You can see it's going to try to populate with at least one profile. But we want to go ahead and select PLA. So we're going to reopen the menu, select PLA. And now we see that Amazon and filaments.ca PLAs are available. So we're going to select one. We'll go down here and select Default. For most materials, default will be the one that is being used for most prints. These are the profiles that are created by Fusion 3. If we would create our own pro profile, we would open the printer settings menu, clicking on the gear icon. This is going to open the settings menu, and we'll get into this deeper into a later video. So we'll go ahead and close that. And that's the basics of just how to select your printer and to select your material type. You may have noticed that under the brand selection, we also have the more materials here as well. You can click either through the material selection or the brand selection. It's gonna open the same menu either way. That's gonna wrap up this video.